a dream bedroom. They are still just dreams for some South Florida families. That's after they all hired the same Delray Beach contractor. Kathleen O'Toole joins us with this Talk to 25 exclusive. Kathleen? Detectives are very aware of this group. The company allegedly lures in homeowners and then shows up so infrequently they're fired. Meantime, families are out tens of thousands of dollars. This is my lovely living room. Sharon Brown really never meant for her house to look like this. This not only disheartens me, it sickens me. When she hired a contractor in December to redo her bedroom and bathroom, she figured by now the work would be long done. I waited, I waited, I waited, I kept calling him. Brown has the cash checks to prove she paid home team advantage of Delray Beach $18,000 for the work. Instead, she says she bought the runaround. I cry about this. It was a weight-bearing wall, mm -hmm. and all they did was uh, cut an opening in it. Same story at Lori Beltran's house. The mother of four boys has a kitchen that still looks like a disaster area. They would come um, for a day and do a little tiny bit of work, then I wouldn't get them back for two weeks. She says she forked over $30,000 after meeting with Doug Livingston. His business card says he's the home team advantage founder. Other than a demolition of her kitchen, she says she got nothing but stalling. It became ridiculous. At first, it was a believable excuse, but then when you got so many ridiculous excuses, it was like, no one has that much bad stuff happen to them. It's just impossible. I've got one person's out 70,000, another person's out, you know, 40,000. Delray Beach Detective Tom Watley is on the case as he says Livingston and Home Team Advantage have been in trouble before. Charges were filed, 60 counts of fraud in, in uh, Broward County under the same deal, and they move up to Palm Beach County and set up shop right up here and go after uh, victims here. Doug Livingston told us he couldn't talk, home ill, recovering from an old concussion. But when we stop by the Home Team Advantage storefront, we hear something different. No. Okay. Uh, Doug is on a sales call with a uh, client at the moment. Beltran and Brown, meantime, wish the company's days of meeting any clients were over. What do you want from these people? I want them to not do this to anyone else, so I would love to see their business shut down. If I see him go to jail, this man go to jail, this will make my heart happy and a lot of other people's hearts happy. Now, we tried to contact the company president, John Ostendorf. We first emailed him almost two weeks ago. We also stopped by today and called his cell phone. We did not get any response. As for the charges in Broward County, they are still pending. Kathleen O'Toole, WPBF News, 25.